uh, one person that that definitely capitalised or kind of came out the other end as a, a massive, massive star of the big boom of Brit rest was uh, this guy here. Uh, oh. The bruiser weight, Pete Dunn. And I'm going to bring up some fun pictures here because similar to Chris Brooks, um, he's another kind of one that's inspired you, that's motivated you, uh, a good friend, um, doing some wonderful things uh, in WWE. Uh, so, so proud of him. I uh, really want him to get his, his WrestleMania moment this year. Uh, but there you are. Look at Pete Dunn looking as happy as ever, I've got to say. <laughs> but tell us a bit about your relationship with, with Pete Dunn because you, you obviously from you know, the same neck of the woods from the from the Midlands, possibly the West Midlands, and uh, uh, I'm guessing that he's kind of somebody that's been you know a huge supporter uh, and influence to you throughout your career. Yes, yeah, so Pete trained me, and that's how we became close. Really, he would train me because we'd get the train to and from training, so I got to know him. And then one day, um, the fight club promoter said, oh, "Okay, you two are going to tag together." And obviously we didn't really know, well, I had no idea what, what the dynamic would be. And he just went, just be how it is normally. Like, he hates me. <laughs> I hate him. <laughs> That's how it is. I think all the, all the tag matches, all the tag teams, like me and Charlie, me and Pete, the reason it's quite successful is because it's just organic. Like, it's just so natural. I feel in and outside the ring, that is, there's no acting. It is just, that is how it is. I swear Pete just pretends to hate me and I just wind him up as much as I can but I hope deep down he likes me really <laughs> like the annoying little sister <laughs> yes yeah but that, that first tag match we had where we won the revolver tag team championships that was just again that was Sammy's promotion who was my favorite and it was just again I don't think anyone thought we would win the championship including myself it was just again that was when we figured out the dynamic of the team obviously n nothing was planned it was just okay we just see how it's going to go and I think to have that much chemistry it was like a little story on going through the match and it's just it was that that match has to be maybe one of my top three for fondest memories yeah, 